All right, so now I'm going to show you how some of these electrolytic foods can be a capacitor. A capacitor, quite simply, is just something that stores electricity. It stores up electricity, and then when it gets full, it releases that electricity, and then as the electricity comes through again, it fills up again, and then it releases it as soon as it's full again. In our oscillator circuit here, we have a, uh, we have a manufactured capacitor right here, and it's determining um, the frequency and the loudness and the function of this circuit. What I'm going to do is I'm going to add in a potato. And we are going to pass the potato through the circuit as well. And we're going to see how that extra capacitance changes the function of the circuit. So I have it plugged in right where my capacitor is in parallel with my capacitor. And now I'm going to take two nails and stick them in there, and we're getting the capacitive action of vibrations of these salts inside the potato, interacting, charging up, and then releasing, charging up and releasing, and adding to my electrical circuit, creating this low beat frequency.